Mark Twain was born Samuel Clemens in 1835 in Florida, USA. He was the sixth of seven children born to John Clemens, a lawyer, and his wife Jane. Although three of Samuel's siblings died in childhood. When Samuel was four, the family moved to Hannibal, a town on the Mississippi River. Samuel loved to watch the river boats and dreamed of being a river boat pilot. Many of his stories were inspired by his adventures in Hannibal. When Samuel was 11, his father died to support his family. Samuel became a printer's apprentice at a Missouri courier. He learned a lot about writing and used public libraries in the evening to educate himself. Later Samuel worked as a typesetter for the Western Union, his brother Orion's newspaper. Samuel created articles and sketches for the paper and became known for his humor. At 17, Samuel left Hannibal and found print work in St. Louis, New York, Philadelphia, and Cincinnati. Then in 1857, he returned to study for 2 years to become a riverboat pilot. But in 1861, saw the end of Samuel's river days once the Civil War started. He moved west to join the Confederate Army. although he left before fighting began after working briefly as a miner he became a reporter for the territorial enterprise in the virginia city nevada and began writing short stories under the name of mark twain these funny tales were full of adventure mark's first popular story the celebrated jumping frog of clever's country was published in 1865 it received international acclaim and soon mark was one of the most famous american celebrities of his day he was asked to write his first and best selling book the innocent abroad 1869 about his travels and other works following including roughing it 1872 the prince and the pauper 1882 and live from the mississippi in 1817 mark married 24 year old olivia langdon the daughter of a rich coal merchant they settled in buffalo new york and had three daughters and a son their son sadly died in infancy parenthood like to mark's famous river novels for children He read each chapter to his family as he wrote them. The Adventures of Tom Sawyer 1876 and its sequel The Adventures of Huckleberry Finn 1884 tells the adventure of two boys on the Mississippi River. Huckleberry Finn in particular has been called the great American novel. A tale of a white boy helping a black man to escape slavery in the southern USA. It was also one of the first novels to feature the everyday language of its characters. Mark Twain's river books have been banned in places as some characters in them use offensive, racist languages that were common at the time of writing. Mark's writing earned him a lot of money but he lost most of it by investing in risky ventures. In 1895 he began a world tour giving lectures to pay off his debts which he did in 1898. When Olivia died in 1904 Mark returned to New York and later moved to Reading, Connecticut. It was here that he died from a heart attack in 1910 aged 74